What do you mean in the sense of love? What do I think of what is love? Baby, don't hurt me. <laughs> I used to think more of the sentimental kind of romantic notions of love, like soulmates and love is conquers all and like movie kind of things. But I don't think that's necessarily what it is, at least to me. I don't think it doesn't exist anymore, but I don't think it conquers all. I don't think it matters. <clears throat> like, I think it just, you know, there's like different kinds. There's like family love, and then there's, you know, just love for animals, or love for objects, or food, or movies, or whatever. And then there's, then there's like that movie kind of love, of like love at first sight, and just, you know, hearts flying, or like in big fish. That kind of idea of like that Romeo and Juliet love messes up a lot of people. Like John would always talk to me about that, like looking for his Juliet. And it's like, you, I think you miss the bigger point, you know? Love is very special. And it's, um, I remember when I was little and uh, pretty much all my, um, or in eighth grade, I dated this girl for um, just to date because that's what people did when they were in eighth grade to date somebody. And you kiss and stuff like that. But, she, you know, I said I love you, but I just I misused the word. And um, it's it, there's a lot of ties to love, and uh, you can't just play around with it. It's very special, and um, it hurts sometimes. But it's true. I would say love is true. right now um, is have I made and am I continuing every day to make the right decision as far as being in LA pursuing the acting stuff is that where I'm supposed to be or is there something more valuable out there that I could pursue or should pursue or it's like is this all for naught or you know what's the or am I going to be an actor you know, so like every day, I, that's the kind of the main thing that I'm like, ugh. And then all the stuff that goes in with that as far as paying my bills and working and then wanting to act on do all stuff and all that time and energy that that takes away from and accomplishing nothing in the last two, a year and a half. Just makes me wonder. So that's just, that's probably my main concern is, is am I on the right road? Is this the right track? My main concern at this time in my life is, uh, I suppose it's a combination of my brother and the rest of my family, and my career, and people that I care about, trying to be as happy as possible, and see if I can assist that in any way, shape, or form. My main concern at this time is to find a home, and to feel like I belong to an environment. Mm. Sadly, it's money. My main concern is that I will not fulfill my potential. I'm afraid. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm afraid, but not exactly. But I do feel a little bit on the edge about certain responsibility as an adult with my finance because I commit so much of my money to my art that I have none to live. Everybody always tells me that I need to live a little. And I, and I do feel that, but, you know, um, I, I still come to my heart. I just can't help it, I, I guess. I just let it over, take over me, kind of, um, but with a certain control. And, um, but my concern is that I'm not making enough money to support my habit. Um, and I think my habit is a good thing. Finding a plan and like planning for the future and being finding finding something to do that I'm happy with and that I feel productive with and that feel like I'm um,
contributing something and, and that I'm going places and doing things and not just kind of staying with a kind of, um, just staying in a rut, you know, I don't want that. My main concern is that I'm just, uh, you know, I'm not gonna see that I'm like standing in my own way. Like I, you know, like I really, I mean, I want to be a successful writer. I can't decide what that means, like if it means I want to, you know, do screenwriting or TV writing or fiction. Basically I want to do all of them, but as I'm kind of deciding on what to focus on, I just sit there paralyzed and I don't do anything and I haven't written in months. I'm paralyzed by worrying about things rather than actually just doing them. Uh, getting my shit together. I'm back in college. And I think that's a wise decision. I go back and forth because I have a lot of things that I want to do and I tend to focus on none of them. And so this is a means for my own sanity. Well, I guess my main concern is uh, trying to be the best person I'm, I'm supposed to be and do the right thing that I was meant to, to do. Uh, and then also loving everybody that's in my life, you know. I, don't, I guess to be able to find some vehicle that I can that I can enjoy myself and, and be creative and be a spoiled American and, and dive into myself, you know, and, and see, you know, what all this is all about. I guess my band, my. Uh, my success. Uh, I know I'm gonna get there, but I don't know how or when. And you know, the the you know, not knowing is what I worry about. And I want every, everyone to be happy. You know, and it's hard. To, you know, I like to please everyone. It's hard to hold a band together and still make it your own. Probably getting into college. I'm supposed to be working on my applications today. I don't know, nothing. Just needing to do something with my life. Um, right now, I would say, I would want to say that my main focus is to um, please God, but I'm not doing that at the moment. Uh, I'm living for myself. And, um, was is not necessarily a bad thing, but being selfish is not good. And um, so, yeah.